Because I do not like This is Galitha. Oh, Hello. Hello. This is Shannon. Yay. <laughs> this is Mr. Caleb. Is that okay? Okay. This is Mr. Caleb and me. Hey, buddy. And then the list is y'all. And it's us. And I'll show y'all the guys. They're over there having a chat. These are the guys. Yay! <laughs> I'm not gonna interrupt them and tell y'all who's who, but these ladies, these lovely ladies' husbands are over there as well as mine. And Shannon, I don't remember. Tell me, um, your other friend who's over there, Marquis. Marquis, yes. So y'all, we know these guys for like from like right? how long? It's 2015, so it's been like 10 years. Yep, nine or 10 years. Yep. We moved to Atlanta in 1990, no, in 2005, 2006. And then we all started, well, Eric and I joined this Bible study, and all of these folks were already a part of it. <laughs> and we kind of joined in. Remember at um, Isla and um, at Mail's house? That's where we all met. At my house, yeah. Yes. So then after that, okay, I'm multitasking, I'm holding the baby and coming. So then after that, Eric and I started the Bible study because um, the other one got big and we split into two. And then Shannon and Richard, who's there in the corner, started coming to our Bible study. And Chad and Galitha lived up, y'all lived more up on this side of town, I think. So they went to a different one, but we all remained friends. So yay! We got to come to Shannon and Richard's house and I'm so happy. I call her Shannon then because that's how you spell Shannon. So this is our reality. See, y'all be thinking I don't know any black people. Because in this world, all you saw were white people. But this was actually our reality right here. We were in Atlanta. <laughs> The one white guy in the yes, room for black people. Yeah. Or, or like a multiracial setting. Um, but for the last four years, this is what they've seen. Me and how much white Wow. <laughs> for the most part. Sometimes you guys know that Yamima will be there or Freedom will be there. But yes. We're back in Atlanta now. He and his new thing is dropping things now. Uh-huh. So you follow him. Yeah. And then you pick it up. To watch him pick it up. Yeah. Is this a cookie maker? No, that's his little cup. Oh, oh this is the kids. Oh, okay. So the kids were... Oh. They're downstairs. And hello. Hi. Say who you are. Pam. This is Pam. Pamela Smith. Yay. Hey. Happy holidays. Yeah, that's right. So I'm showing everybody what the kids were doing. They were making cookies. So the kids were in here. Okay. Oh, it looks like a disaster area. But they were decorating Christmas cookies. <laughs> These are Josh's cookies. Here's his Christmas tree and the nativity, Mary Joseph and Jesus. And then Kalani made, oh, well, I don't know, this might not be Kalani. This is one of the kids' cookies. One of the girls, I think. And then, <laughs> those are cute, aren't they? Mm -hmm. then this is, yeah, these are Kalani's, because here's her Santa Claus next to her McDonald's cup. And something else here. Isn't that cute? Fun. And the kids are down here. Tanya, please look. What are they doing? <laughs> Oh my goodness! Oh my gosh, y'all. Yeah. All right, cheerleaders of America. Are they seriously? Come on, do it. Are y'all serious? Go, go. Yeah, she would rather ride a horse. <laughs> hey guys. Wow. Can everybody say hi? Kalani, get up on Josh's back and join. Woo! One, two, three. Woo! Say ready. Okay. <laughs> They're oh like, my I'm goodness. right. Did you get down now? You did. Do you feel proud of yourself? I can, I can see it. Guys, so it is Christmas Day. Merry Christmas. And I am at my mom's house. Eric and mom are in the dining room. They are cooking, 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 and talking about food and plans and whatnot for dinner. I will come into the living room to show you our. Christmas funness, Merry Christmas. There is the tree and the explosion underneath <laughs> all of the fun opening gifts that we've done today. And um, I realized that I haven't really shown you guys my mom's house at all, which is okay. But I've been here like a week already <clears throat> and I'm, I feel like I'm chasing them out of the room. Anyway, here's the dining room table. We're about to eat, eat, eat. There's mom, and I'll introduce you properly soon for all of y'all who actually haven't seen my old videos when mom came to visit us in Israel. Here's mom. Say hi, ma. Hi. They need to see your face. 
There's mom. There's that guy. You know that guy back there. And let me show y'all what they're making. Oops, sorry. I am still using my phone, so I'm going to figure this bad boy out. Although, Eric bought me a new camera today! Yay! With the flippy screen. I'm so happy. It's a Nikon. Um, cool pick. So I'm super excited about that. But let me show you guys the food. Well, it's not really food to show yet. So let me just tell you guys what's happening. Let me get out of their way, because they're all in task mode. They're all in work, work, work. Task, task, task. Cook, cook, cook. I came down to try to help set the table. It felt like I got kind of chased out of the room. So I'm just going to leave and go outside. Ah, out front. Okay. So I have not done anything with my hair but take my twists out today. But that's okay. Um, I've had twisted hair. I used a new product. I used Carol's. No, it wasn't Carol's daughter. That Body Beautiful, Karen's Body Beautiful, is that what it's called? I used um, a moisturizing cream and it was really nice. I liked it and I just retwisted my hair one night and it came out really well. But you can't really tell maybe, but it moisturized it really well and held it nicely. Okay, anyway, let me look at the, at the button on the phone instead of at myself in the screen, <laughs> the viewfinder. Um, let me tell you what they have made, okay? Because I'm so excited, I'm ready to eat. They have made plantain. My mom made fried plantain. Eric made mac and cheese and okra. And what else did that man make? His vegetable, his like potato, sweet potato medley, except he didn't put any squash in it this time. It's just only sweet potatoes. Um, with of course the rosemary, the garlic, and the cranberries. So yum. Um, they got a honey baked ham. Mom made a chicken and some cabbage. I'm so happy. I'm so hungry. And I've got a headache because I need protein. Okie dokie, guys. I want to give you a good picture of mom because you don't really get to see mom much because, you know, she doesn't always, I don't think she always has her look like she wants it, so I don't want to get her on film. Um, but today she's got her hair all did and her makeup on and stuff. So. I'm going to show you her. And I know she's going to watch this and comment. Look at me in the mirror there. So let me show y'all what there is to eat. Is it still it's cooking? not even out yet. I'm telling them. Can they see you, Ma? Oh, well, okay. Okay, okay. Outfit of the day. Look at this. Yes, yes. <laughs> don't, look at the, don't look at the feet. <laughs> They're not there yet. Look at y'all. My mom went natural three years ago. Three years ago, mom? Two, yeah, two, two and a half years ago. And it looks fantastic. Oh, okay. Look at, show us, Eric. It's just okra. That's don't it. Burn me. Come here, honey. What? It's not just okra. It is just okra. I would be impressed. Can you, let's start over. Look at what Eric made. Okra. <laughs> I love okra, guys. I love it. You can come do back there. Them. Well, this right pretty. here is. Tell us what it is, man. What is it? It's called chicken. <laughs> it never did have a name. It's chicken. It's chicken. Oh, it's the one that you made last night. Yep. Okay, chicken. this is the skillet chicken, guys. I think I've made it before and shown you. Maybe not, but this is. Yeah. Um, Mom is reheating it from last night, and it is delicious. I love it very much. Skillet chicken with like peppers and. Peppers and, and onions ginger and garlic and, and ginger and yeah. whatever. What kind of stuff like that? You need and to get um, away already. I didn't even set this pan down. This is a plantain, which I think I'm going to have it off too. too. It's it's a little bit without mom seeing me do this. The pan in so. Mmm. Mmm. This is cabbage. Cabbage. Oh yeah, field peas. I forgot to mention the field peas outside. Field peas. Out, did they? No, they look fine. All right. Mmm. That was delicious. So I'm gonna get out of their way because they just go <laughs> down in here. Hmm. We're just what? All about your cooking. Oh, look at Eric made, y'all. No, don't show him this one. This is the bad one. Don't show him this one. Eric, he made two apple pies, y'all. You already know Eric. Yeah, you know what a perfectionist cook he is. 
Let me tell you if that pie is going to taste as delicious as it looks, so I'm not worried. No, it's not. This one's better, and I'll tell you why. I forgot to put the drops of butter in this one before I put the top crust on. This one I remember. It's important. It makes a difference. My uncle is down there. Hey, Uncle Chip. Hey. My uncle's watching the basketball game. <laughs> You're going to be on my movie. <laughs> Doing? Good. Do you want to say hi to my, my viewers? This is my uncle. Does he look just like my mom? Y'all look just alike. <laughs> That's my uncle Chip guy. And see, my uncle, my mom's brother. <laughs> and I love him. He's staying here with mom. Watching um, Oklahoma? Oklahoma against uh, Chicago. Okay, good stuff. So Uncle Chip and I, we, we just eat after they cook. Yeah. That's what we do. <laughs> All right, Uncle Chip. I'll turn the light off. All right, so it's weird for me because y'all have never been in my domain, like in the... It's weird for me because y'all have never been in my domain stateside. And um, in Iowa, that's not where I grew up. Obviously, that's where I am now with Eric's family, but I didn't grow up there. I didn't grow up here, but this is where I spent my last three years of high school. And then um, I went from here to college at the University of Georgia. So this is my mom's house. I'm just wanting to show y'all because I want y'all to see this driveway. I might have to ask her actually if I can even show this footage, but my mom has a heck of a driveway, y'all. I don't know if you can tell, that driveway is like at a 50 degree angle <laughs> like it's intense when we first moved here from new york i was the kid that was gonna continue riding my bike and my roller skates outside like i did in new york i was all busting my butt coming down that driveway on my skates and i never tried that again it's hot guys it's so hot it's like in the 70s 60s and 70s right now those of you who are in atlanta right now on christmas day you know what i mean it's been rainy it's been flooding um it's hot in the house it's like roasting because all the cooking that's been happening Eric's parents also said it was cool even in Iowa but to, look there's people walking down the street in t-shirts <laughs> um, Eric's parents said that it had been warmer actually in Iowa during the week but they got snow last night so they got a white Christmas yesterday and today it snowed um, and I'm sure Josh is a bit disappointed because he wanted a white Christmas but that don't happen usually when you're in Georgia it was hit or miss when we lived when I grew up in New York but it's definitely not happened here but I don't mind being able to come outside in a, a t-shirt and my new jeans. Look at my jeans, y'all. Ignore my slippers. <laughs> and tonight, when we go out, we're going, to, we're going to see Star Wars tonight. Yay! We're taking the kids to see it. We're taking ourselves to see it. Because um, Eric and I also really want to see it. So I'll get to wear just a sweater, and I should be fine. I mean, I'll wear a sweater over the shirt sweater, too, because it gets cold in theaters. But I'm excited because I don't have to have my coat and massive boots and all of this stuff. Like, I can do this. It is unseasonably warm for December in Georgia, but I'm, I'll take it. I will take it. 